in this video I'm going to try and explain to you how data is structured in StarCraft 2 to give you an idea about data objects and show you an overview of what a unit looks like in StarCraft 2 in terms of its data components. Next we're going to look at the data editors layout and show you how to navigate from data object to data object. Then we're going to look at how linked data objects are presented in the editor and find the marine's weapon. Finally we're going to look at the marine's weapon and its structure. In StarCraft 2, a unit is made up of groups of data objects linked to each other. In comparison to WarCraft 3, for example, StarCraft 2's data is separated into parts that serves as building blocks of a unit, where in WarCraft 3, a unit type is predefined. For example, the footman's weapon we can't change how it does damage but can only change how much damage that weapon does. In StarCraft 2 we can define what composes a unit for example define its weapon and how that weapon does damage. We can in a sense combine parts of a knight, mage and zeppelin in StarCraft 2. So again a unit in StarCraft 2 is made up of a group of data objects which are linked together and where each of these groups make up a certain part of a unit say weapon or an ability they are reusable or can be used by other units as well so again when looking at the data editor I tend to look at it as creating parts of a unit using the components available within the limits of the available data types in StarCraft 2.